Hello, my name's Ryan Smith. I'm also known as The Scientist. And we're at my Chaos Theory project at NR Studios in London. And I've just been doing a collaboration with my good friend, Jay Freestyle. We've been working on an arm piece. What we did with this piece is, I noticed the customer had a, a very, very straight arm when she had her ha arm down at the side, which is, is not that usual with clients. So we decided to make full use of that, didn't we? Yeah, her arm was yeah, pretty much a, almost a perfect cylinder. So we thought to use that to our advantage, sort of optically change the shape of her arm and just like make this insane straight line that goes basically through the fingertips around. And then, yeah, we cinched it in in the middle by blackening everything out. Yeah, it was cool. Yeah, it just gives a totally different look to the arm, doesn't it? Like you say, it sort of optically challenges what you're used to seeing for the arm, but I think it went really well. I think for me, it was very exciting about how we went around the fingers. It was just a crazy idea, wasn't it? You know, I'm quite glad the client was up for it because it managed to help us uh, make a really, really unique piece. I mean, I, I've personally not seen a piece like this before. No. no. So for both of us, it was a really unique piece to do. I think it was it was quite a challenge for us both, wasn't it? Because on an arm, it's quite thin. Yeah, the structure of it, I think, well, because obviously there's straight lines. We couldn't work on it together because they had to be crisp. So it's a lot of on and off. Her arm was pretty small. So yeah, we couldn't really work on it together. It was a lot of just, yeah, switching. Yeah, things. swapping backwards and forwards. When you have something like a leg or a back or something, there's so much more space around you than to work with and lean on and everything. With an arm where it's a thin, it's, it's not too much and you've got to keep turning things around and it's just it's not always ideal um, if an arm's too small when you're doing a collaboration, but we still managed to do a really, really cool piece with what we did. I mean, it did take a little while where we had to keep breaking it up like that, didn't it? but I think the uh, end result is a, is a truly exquisite, unique piece of artwork.